gets cold out there, but today's Mixology Monday creation just might warm you up. Randall Danner from McCoy's Public House is here mixing up something really special and perfect yes. for this time of year. What are you making? Absolutely perfect. Um, I am going to be making our spice sangria. It's one of our really popular drinks at McCoy's Public House, and we're going to use hard cider, Sauvignon Blanc, a little bit of apple schnapps, and uh, some cinnamon whiskey, so it's definitely going to warm you up for the season. Sounds good. Let's yeah. get working. Okay, great. Well, you know, the first thing that you want to do is you want to kind of chop up some, some fruit and make mm -hmm. it a little bit um, in bigger chunks, just so so that you have uh, a, something that's a little bit more beautiful to, to look at, kind of as a garnish. Because normally sangria, you see lemons and oranges. Right. This is obviously a little bit more seasonal. So it's going to definitely so be pears. more fall. So we're going to mm -hmm. use a, a Bosch pear, um, some Fuji apples, and some frozen cranberries. So I just picked out some dull frozen cranberries out of the the freezer section at, Those the, look great. at the grocery store. So it adds a lot of um, vibrant color to mm -hmm. the cocktail. So, okay. uh, but real simple. You just pretty much take a bottle of Sauvignon Blanc. I chose the Cupcake Sauvignon Blanc, so you can choose any kind that you like. We're just going to pour it in a pitcher. Now, with this, you really kind of want to make it about a day in advance, mm -hmm. just so that you can let the flavors come together. Um, you're going to get some of the flavors of the pear and the apple and the cranberries, and the cranberries are going to really add such a, a pretty color to to the cocktail once it sits a little bit. And this is a great signature drink for a party if you're having Absolutely. folks over over the holidays. Absolutely. This is perfect. Great for Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. um, Christmas cocktails. Yeah, so we're going to use a cup of, um, I use sour apple pucker just to give a little bit more tartness, but mm -hmm. you can use any kind of apple schnapps that you'd like, depending on the tartness that you want to use. Now, usually sangria, you add sugar and you have a little mm -hmm. sweetness to it. Do you add sugar to this? We're not going to add no. any sugar to no it. No sugar. Just because there's enough sweetness to the apple pucker and mm -hmm. uh, even with the hard cider that it that adds enough sweetness. Great. So we're just going to add that in there. And then it looks pretty too. Yes. <laughs> and we're going to do a cup of the Fireball Cinnamon Whiskey. Mm -hmm. And once again, you can use any kind of cinnamon whiskey. This is just the one that we prefer. And you like the combination of the flavors. Yes, yes. With the mm -hmm. apple and cinnamon, it really gives it that, that holiday spice kind of flavor to it. Just add those. It smells great. Stir it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then we're just going to add in our fruit. So we've got great. about one whole apple, one whole Bosch pear. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, the cranberries. The cranberries. So do you leave it just uncovered? Just put the pitcher yeah, right in the fridge? Yeah, you can leave it uncovered, put the pitcher in the fridge, just let it sit there. Mm -hmm. um, the cranberries do like to float, so <laughs> that works out well, but just mixing it up and... Is this one for me? That one's for you, All but right. it's not quite ready. It's not... It's still good. It's still good. You could yeah. you could make it that day. Right, you could absolutely. But uh, this one's been sitting oh about 12 hours or so, mm -hmm. so it adds uh, a little bit more color to it. But that's really uh, good. Let's add some ice to it real quick. I'm just gonna use this. Okay. So let's pop it off. And you just gotta make sure you don't choke on a cranberry. Don't choke on a cranberry. <laughs> now what we're gonna do is we're gonna add some hard apple cider. So this okay. is five percent alcohol. This is Strongbow from England. Again, hard apple cider in Europe means that it's alcoholic, alcoholic. as opposed to apple yes. cider here, which uh -huh. is apple juice, apple essentially. Juice, yes. Right. Absolutely. Well, delicious. And you have an event coming up, the Feast of... We do. Feast of Sammy Claus, mm -hmm. which is coming up uh, in December. I believe it's December 17th. And um, it's going to be about $60, but that mm -hmm. also includes tax and gratuity. And we do a whole theme of um, different beers from, from European countries, and so the theme will be foods paired with those beers. Should be a lot of fun. Randall, yeah. thank you for coming on thank the show. You. We appreciate it.